Okay, so lesson four. This is the two-handed C major scale. Now, this is a little bit more tricky than the mirror scale. The mirror scale is fairly easy compared because you are switching your thumbs at the same time. And then when you come back down, you are swooping your middle fingers at the same time. Now, this is a skill that needs to be repeated over and over and over again. When I was learning keyboard, I had to sit here and do this for hours. Now, don't be disheartened by that. This can be fun. Do your time trial. See if you can beat the times that you do. I'm going to show you how it all works. On your right hand, as in lesson one, you start on C and it goes one, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Then it comes back down five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one. With your left hand, it's the opposite. So it starts on that five. Five, four, three, two, one, three, two, one. And then comes back down. One, two, three, one, two, three, four, five. Now, here's the tricky bit. Doing it at the same time. Best of luck. Let me show you how it works. I can't say the numbers now because we're doing different numbers. So watch my fingers carefully. Can you see how my middle finger is coming over at a different time than my thumb is swinging or it, 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 it all looks different on here. Watch one more time. Starts on five, starts on one. Here we go. The reason I can do this like this is that I have practiced my right and my left so much that the muscle memory is when I come down through there, I sweep my thumb. When I come up through here, I, you know, it, it's all part of without me even really thinking about it. And this is because I've repeated, 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 repeated. Make sure you understand that you won't get this straight away. Persevere. Keep on going, guys. Here we go. The two handed scale, five and one starting together. One more time. My tip for this is your middle fingers are actually synced when you're coming down and when you're coming up. Watch. Oh look, my middle fingers are together. That is my cue for my right to come up. And then look, my cue there, when my thumb runs out, is for my middle on my left to come up. And there's my middle on my right again. They are the synchronized fingers. Be aware of your middle fingers. Here it comes again, as you're coming back down. Oh look, middle fingers, that means something's gonna happen. Under it comes. Oh, there's the middle fingers and I need to come over there. Middle finger sync. Okay, time for the time trial. Here we go, on your marks. Get set. Seven point two. Can you beat that at home? Good luck. Make sure you post and tell me what's going on with these videos and what you like and what you don't. Can you beat seven point two for your two handed scale? Best of luck.